right? Uh, yeah, you look like, yeah. Okay, cool. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the Bad Comedy Podcast. My name is Ham Talent, and I'm here with... Uh, they call me the Chubby Chaser. The, the Chubby Chaser. And then we got, <laughs> uh, of course... Uh, Joe Rogan. Jo- Joe Rogan. And then the very funny, talented uh, guy... Sam Talent. No, <laughs> no, I'm he, the guy that they put talent in his name for a reason. This man has it all. Wow, what are you? <laughs> every host at every bad club giving me an intro? Mm-hmm. I got Good a question. Work. For you pull you. a mess. Well, okay, right Where do away. you get your ideas? Jesus Christ. Is that what we're doing here? <laughs> Jism Meltman. <laughs> <laughs> huh? I'm man. doing it, Dylan. Look at me. Nice. <laughs> what, what about so? What you just pretend to be Puerto Rican? That's your whole thing. <laughs> I, uh, I'm appropriating. You yeah. should call him. Yeah, Jason. He actually grew up very early. He calls you uh-huh. a pig. You should call him a cow. Like cow? You, and you milk him, Jason. Milk him. Man. Well, if you can't tell by my card shirt, I'm actually a whale. Yeah, I thought that was a <laughs> tarred shirt. I can see your gut <laughs> under there. Yeah, yeah. Well, a whale. Yeah. Whatever. Uh-huh. So this is a. Uh, <laughs> a bad comedy uh, and uh, Bohemian chubby Bohemian episode. chubby chaser. No, this is a uh, Sam Talent does Melton and his friends a favor podcast. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's what yeah. this is. Hell yeah, dude! Uh, he's, he's, Hell yeah. yeah, I could yeah. see us getting two, maybe three new subscribers. You guys are gonna blow up. <laughs> It's a good pod. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah. It's hey, are you too stupid for come town? <laughs> are you not smart enough to get the nuance of lemon party? Come on over oh, here. Dude. Watch three more fucking well, yeah. two white guys and whatever you're trying to be. Uh-huh. He, yeah, he's not white at all. Yeah. He's uh, he's yeah. actually very urban. Uh-huh. He's, uh, he's not urbane, I'll tell you that. He, he has well, cauliflower. He's Keith Urbane. Uh-huh. You know, you guys call flower here. <laughs> You're gonna smoke in here? Yeah. What do you want? This isn't your house. I smoke wherever I want, dude. Mm-hmm. Is this your house? I smoke in a this Capitol building. This is your house? Yeah. You I, just let him do whatever he wants. I, yeah, I, I own it. I own the condo. You own this place? Yeah. Whoa! I didn't know I was in a rich guy's house. Yeah, mm-hmm. I made it all from comedy. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. You sold bunk ketamine enough and yeah. fucking champagne, <laughs> Illinois. How do you, you move to the How do you think city. I can afford this big of a dollar, uh, hundred yeah, dollar bill? I thought you went right to the mint. Do you know how much that cost? Yeah, this is that, more yeah, than hundred. That cost like a hundred, uh, a, th- a thousand, mm-hmm. hundred dollar bills, yeah, wow. really which is a hundred thousand dollars. Yeah. 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 Never heard of it. Have I ever heard of a hundred thousand dollars? Yeah. Probably not. I'm gonna pull up an app on my phone. <laughs> uh oh. Make your yeah. dick disappear. What? <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> I could pay to have your dick removed. Oh, I'm yeah, rich. Right. Yeah, right. What do you, you too late? It's <laughs> not it's not removed. It's if it's in your mouth, it's just hidden. What what uh, what, what bank do you use? Titty bank? Magician never <laughs> tells. Titty bank. Yes. <laughs> you're big you're fat. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, thanks for explaining it. I yeah. kinda would want a bank there, I think. Or, or because there's a lot of hot women there. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. a good bank. Mm-hmm. We love hot women here. Yeah, folks. you're married, right? Uh-huh. <laughs> I heard this rumor that uh, she holds you upside down. You guys, uh, you were standing sixty nine. Sixty nine. You watched a clip of mine and you thought it was a rumor. Yeah, you were like, "Oh, who's no, spreading I, these mistruths?" I, I, I heard this crazy rumor. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I saw you live at Humble Jungle. Yeah, um, yeah. We've met one time outside of Lincoln Lodge. Yeah, I know. I, ca- I kept coming up to me and being like, "Jason, will you introduce me to my hero? <laughs> <laughs> will you introduce me to Mister Talent?" No. Jason was like, "Shut up, you bitch!" No. And you were like, "Thanks, keep talking to me." None that of this way. was said. I just said at Humble Jungle, I said, "Just what's up?" Yeah, yeah. and I was like, yeah, yeah, that's that's right, I, I, keeps making those unseen videos." <laughs> you are sort of like a hero to all the. Donnie Townsend's of the world. <laughs> I don't name drop. I didn't know we were going to talk about our you, favorite celeb you crushes. Always, you get all these guys to love you like uh, Mac and Donnie. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, I, I, wanted to, <laughs> I, I, I wanted to kill him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If, if you go back on the clips, I had, had my gun. And I what was, it made you forgive him? I was ready to kill him. <laughs> yeah. Well, how did you forgive him? Um, because he came on the podcast. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah thanks, Sam. Yeah, the, yeah thanks for coming on the podcast, dude. I'm glad to do it. Do you like I'm my stewed? My stewed here. I'm very impressed with the production value. Yeah. Here. So that's I thought all. it would just be in like a pillow fort that Melton erected. So yeah. <laughs> when him and his when him and his intimate partner make love, she doesn't have to see his face. Yeah. Hey. Um, yeah. That's called doggy style. She can still smell your face though. <laughs> yeah. Is it, is can you smell the pussy on my dick right now? <laughs> your I'm face sorry, reeks. dude. My dick smells like pussy right now. I'm sorry, everybody. Yeah, she you pictures fuck that version of it. Yeah. <laughs> you fuck your cat? I, I've been having an issue with my cat. He, uh, the, he keeps on... Uh, we hit a band, the laser pointer. He keeps on attacking Indian guys' foreheads now. 
That's such a huge problem. <laughs> do you know what to do? Yeah, I know what to do. <laughs> yeah, like, put this out behind genocide, a paywall. <laughs> genocide on Hindus? <laughs> God. Look at you smoking your fake cigarettes. <laughs> you appropriate cool guy culture for such a fucking loser. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm wearing a Samuel L. Jackson hat. <laughs> yeah, you are. Yeah. He's a cool loser. He, he's really been trying to become cool recently, Jason has. Yeah, he's but that's why Texas I got this cool Hold'em. Texas Hold'em shirt, and these cool glasses, yeah. and this cool hat. It's really holding <laughs> your tits in. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> look at you figuring out how to sit on camera. That's I knew good. my tits. Were I gotta look super casual because I don't even see my man cleavage. <laughs> I knew. I knew my cleavage or... was shown because I seen you licking your lips over there. You want to suck on my tits? I don't want anything to do with your nude body. <laughs> I hate knowing that you have nipples. Will you lay on top of me? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Sam. I want to be warm. How would it, how would being on top be intimate for either of us? So I have a good be, idea. So no, you don't. Whatever no. you're about to say, no, no I'm going to go on a limb and say it's not a good idea. I, I promise. I have, okay. He has a Medea. Uh, I have a Medea. Uh-huh. So <laughs> me, me, you, uh, me, you, Jason, and Dale McPeak will hang out. Okay. Okay. And, pass. Um, basically, <laughs> no. So basically, it'll be in the winter and it'll be freezing. So uh, uh, yeah. so we'll cut open. Actually, we'll probably cut open you and put Dale inside of you. <laughs> and then yeah, uh, it's like Star Wars, dude. Yeah, and then we'll cut open Dale and put him inside of Dale. Like in Star Wars, and uh-huh. then I'll cut open you, and I'll go inside of you. We'll be like a nesting doll of different people trying to be warm. Yeah, yeah. Just keep doing my opener. That's good. Is that your opener? <laughs> you said this guy was cool. <laughs> you said this guy was quiet. I could open for you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know that was a joke. I swear to God. Yeah, right. It's that's, okay. That's, Everyone that's, copies me. What you have a joke Wait, about, you about about me and you and uh, Jason. Uh-huh. Uh, just being inside each other, going inside each other, for and Dale work. McPeak. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> wherever I go, I got to throw McPeak in there. Yeah, yeah. To throw Take a big peek. Snail McPeak. He lost a lot of weight recently. Dale. <laughs> Kale McPeak. Yeah, he's really thin now. He lost like two hundred pounds. He I goes, wish I knew who that was. He I does. Cared. He says yeah. people call him Big Homie, and then nobody laughs because yeah, he's not him. big anymore. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, that's that's this weird guy. We know. Where do they call mm-hmm. him Big Homie when he sits courtside when, at the Globetrotters game? Yeah, they're homeless people. Call him big homie. What up, big dog? <laughs> you, you, got a, you got a world tour coming up, huh? Yeah, I'm not going to plug the dates on here. <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> what, you, what? You don't want our awesome fans going? Yeah. I don't want your people going. No. We actually have a sponsor. <laughs> you guys make me nervous. <laughs> I can imagine the people who listen to this being more pleasant. <laughs> you guys get 25% off on the cool steeper club.com. Uh-huh. It's T subscription. Yeah. We're That's going the testosterone? To What's uh, the... My cousin Thomas. No, tea. My cousin Thomas like, uh, in Denver. He but, moved to Denver. Like drinking tea. My little oh. brother Jake moved there, too. I've been trying to get my family <laughs> to hang out with you. I would love to. I love you. Would you want to hang out with my family? <laughs> yeah, for sure. My little brother Jake like moved to the woods. He has no friends at all. Yeah, He's yeah. kind of a psycho. He learned that from you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, being a lonely, oh, 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 being oh. a lonely jerk runs in the family. <laughs> so uh, you yeah, guys yeah. wanted me to come on here and neg you guys, but I don't want to do that. No, you we, know, I, I want to be mean to you. No, we said oh. we, we said you could come out here and preg us. <laughs> you wanted me to come on and, oh, and I wanted you to uh, peg us. us. Yeah, <laughs> I was gonna try and figure out no, a colorful way to say you something that rhymes with neg. No, you, <laughs> <laughs> that's why you. Have I came over so you can say it, right? Yeah, yeah. When people say, pretty much doing it all for the N word pass. I don't. Yeah. I don't like her as a person. Yeah. I, get it. Mm-hmm. I feel even nervous to say like when someone negs people what they'd be called. Uh-huh. That even worries me to say. What do they become? A pickup artist. Yeah, <laughs> it's bad, dude. No, it's like Pua. It, it's like pegger with an N. Yeah, new, yeah. New pegger. I can't even. I can't even say that. We all did the it's math. Too close, <laughs> you know. Uh-huh. I've, yeah. I've been. Uh, I did the math. There's an open mic called Trigger Warning. <laughs> oh, I know. I know this story. You know when you I, do I, algebra, I, I, you're I, I, always figuring out stuff to the nth <laughs> power. No, I've, 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 I've been thinking about starting a new version of it. I, I've been starting a new version it of starts the nth power. Yeah, you're just doing Bobby Bud's joke now. It's called New Trigger Warning. Yeah, okay. There we go. Damn. Wait, is that a Bobby Bud's joke? Yes! From when? From Bobby a long Bud. time ago when he did Trigger Warning. Bobby He's Buds like, has never called me out on saying yeah. that. Yeah. Bobby Remember when you used to go by Blobby Buds? Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah, And then I gained all that weight. Yeah. <laughs> no one could see my tumors anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I was Mound Man. Yeah. Remember when we first Is that met? why you gained weight? To cover the tumors? Yeah, because my protuberances were too uh, profound on stage. <laughs> Denied <laughs> my ass. Nice. Getting involved. Are you okay? Are they benign tumors? Uh, they're benign and a half. <laughs> <laughs> I prefer baton. So Lay it on me, nasty. I like baton humor. Baton tumors. Yeah. You know? mm-hmm. 
So this is the podcast that you call me and bother me on once a week, huh? Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. No, I've called you once. One, one dude. time. No, this you... is my impression of Sam. Once, I once him. a lifetime. Oh, I'm in traffic. Uh, help! Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. Well, luckily yeah, that was like, that oh, episode. Great podcast, we, Sam. We fucked up that episode, so no. Never even came out. No, I got to hear that. Oh, yeah. No, man, that was such seminal work on our behalf. I know. Yeah. yeah. Me in good. traffic in Houston, <laughs> furious. <laughs> I'm driving. Uh, I can't be funny. Yeah. <laughs> well, if you guys ever worked the road. You know it's difficult out there. Oh, uh, we know? do. Yeah, you, you can check out our car road. podcast. Yeah, and, uh, you, know, you can, you can, you can work my toad. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. About you can rub my chode. Yeah, we we tour, we, we tour to Pittsburgh and we threaten to kill Stephen Hofstetter all the time. Oh, that's oh good. yeah, yeah. We've gone to Pittsburgh like three times. Wow. Uh huh. That place is freaky. You notice the comics are all like uh, chemical mutants. Yeah, they're all like it, freaky. They always have like a. They got like teeth under their teeth. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe you didn't go to the mic. If you check out a mic there, it's yeah, it's nuclear. You got a guy who looks like Evan Hull, but he's twice as tall. Yeah, we call, yeah, we call him Evan, we call him Evan Hulk. Yeah, yeah. Well, they have Joe Ash, <laughs> who's like a Joe Ash. Yeah, yeah. He, I didn't even know that guy was gay because he's so dirty, secret homosexual. Yeah, yeah. he's too filthy to have You're sex like, with men. I thought you guys ha- hang out in bathhouses all day. How? Wh- why are you still covered in dirt? Yeah, I thought right. that there was certain levels of maintenance that you guys had to adhere to. Yeah, yeah. like they have really nice ha- like homes. Yeah. <laughs> and he, and talk, he, talk, he talks like this he's always excited and he's like oh, I want to get sucked off I, I want to suck somebody and my <laughs> holes loose you sound like a halal guy hey it's how I sound hey you, I was you, really, want, you want red and white because I just got white I was really mad I was on a show with him and he was right before me and he stole my bit about falling before yeah, yeah. you go on stage yeah. <laughs> or do you just, it, Matt was Lord. super pissed, was super pissed. Yeah. but he still yeah. also did the fall down bit so the crowd was, and the crowd was all over 50 and they were like, "What the fuck? Is this? <laughs> what is this show?" So you then stole Mo took- Alexander's bit. What? Mo, Mo Alexander? Alexander yeah. yeah. No. What do you guys falls, know Mo? Does he roll and then land back on his feet like a weeble wobble? Well, that's why they call him Mo because he's perpetual motion. <laughs> I actually, so I big. actually, I did it on. Stage I thought his the- sedentary lifestyle was how he got that way. <laughs> No, he fell down going on stage at Go Bananas and Cincy, and he had to do his set from his back because they didn't have enough people to lift him. <laughs> they didn't have an, uh, an engine crane. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> they didn't have an excavator. I, I injured myself uh, <laughs> doing a fall on stage at Enjoy. Oh, no. <laughs> and I kept doing it. That's how much I love comedy. I'll die oh, yeah. for this shit. Uh-huh. <laughs> so passionate. Yeah. I like that. It's like Passion of the Christ. Kind uh-huh. of. Yeah. Mo, Mo had to Bears sell his merch from his back on stage. <laughs> <laughs> he's laid up there with his. This sp- Mo guy's huge. He's so big. Yeah, yeah. kind of yeah. like Adam Gilbert. Yeah, yeah. yeah. he's like he's like uh, the opposite of Adam Gilbert. Show him the, show him the samurai Adam Gilbert's like one of his toes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this, we got uh, this Adam, is a, Gilbert Adam, Adam Gilbert Adam Gilbert samurai sword. Samurai sword. <laughs> nice. Yeah. That's good. Did you hear Custom. Adam Gilbert was really depressed and he tried to kill himself? Well, I guess, I guess hang he himself with floss. He jumped off a curb. Nice. Okay. <laughs> you know that when he's having sex with a woman and he uh, and he wants to pull out, he just shoots a twelve gauge shotgun and flies away. <laughs> do every time. Always scares the woman. And... Uh, he's co- he's coming on the podcast next time yeah. he's in town. You're gonna have to get a small chair for him. Yeah, you guys uh, really sure. emphasize that you got yeah. the biggest chair in town. Mac mm-hmm. is literally gonna have to buy his first book so that we, Adam could sit on it. Encyclopedia. Yeah. Encyclopedia <laughs> set. The first time I met Gilbert was with you at the, was that the, uh, the at Let's that Comedy Office, and he was still drinking. At the office? Yeah, and Alex Price I slept was up carrying there a couple times. him. <laughs> this is the three biggest guys, and then. <laughs> yeah, and Lasso, you know. So. Yeah, yeah. And, their, and their floss. Alex Dave Price Lasso. was. You, you good? <laughs> What? He's oh no! Like, I'm just trying to talk, and you keep just fucking yeah. ruining it with All some right. bullshit. Go ahead, tell your no, no, tell okay. your incredible story. I can't wait. No, no, do I'm more sure jokes you read on Cracked.com. <laughs> I'm sure this will be incredible. Tell me about Adam Gilbert. No, no, please, more please. Like I can, the, I can incredible, wait. the incredible Evan Hulk. Yeah, <laughs> come on, let's go. Are tell you me sure? your story. I want to not like it. Okay, I'm prepared to not. <laughs> well, like I don't it at like the story because you were involved. Well, I wasn't even there. I don't know what you're talking about. You were there. No, you were probably trying to finger some NB. Uh-huh. Not binary? Yeah. Hey man, uh, I'm actually I it was not be binary. No. I hate pickles. Uh-huh. He doesn't even play pickleball yeah, anymore. Yeah, I won't even play pickleball. I'm not binary. I'm allergic to Christmas trees. Yeah. <laughs> All right. See. <laughs> Do That's good. Pickle. Yeah, we've done, we've done it every podcast. Oh, good. <laughs> that joke? Yeah, no, he thinks it's a Both those jokes. <laughs> wow. 
Okay, okay, okay continue your story. Yeah. No, no, no. Shut up, okay. Jason. Come no. on, this is a brand new story. No, I want fucking Velvet Fog to talk over me. And I'll tell you like a story about that hog. office. This guy to murmur, and I can't even hear it for <laughs> some <laughs> reason. Yeah, I don't think I'm my mic, son. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's on. It's but just, it's you're on. turned down in my phone. No. Yeah, why don't you turn me up? Because this is what happens. They talk over me. They talk over each other. We turn them down, and so I kind of talk under them. Yeah. So then they tell you that I'm quiet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's just I mean, because, you are quiet. <laughs> uh-huh. He's here to uh, he's here to uh, give our listeners like a, a like a what it feels like to have schizophrenia. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. It's like a background voice talking. Also to kind of, of to kind of bother the now. guests, like to kind of like uh, yeah, they, like worry them. Because the, they the don't guests know. always say, "Why is he here?" Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> they always say that. So you got the text I sent you. <laughs> Why is he wearing chains? <laughs> oh, wait, fuck. wait, the text that said, "Make sure there's no one in between me and the bathroom when I get there." <laughs> when I when I introed Sam, I forgot to do this. <laughs> Nice, you did. And then Thank when you. Sam made it, and then I forgot to do this one too. You're back. gay. <laughs> do some of mine. Give him the give him the effect. Which, the which one? Yeah. Oh, this one's good. Welcome to the party, pal. <laughs> do my catchphrases. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's, we're this trying. Fun for me. We're uh, trying to slowly phase Dylan out of the podcast. Yeah, we're, so we've been re- we've been Can't recording. Understand why? Yeah, Go we've we've been recording everything he says normally on the yeah. podcast, which is nice, nice. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And then what we're else? at a schedule. Hell folks. yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> so I think of it as a mind bending experience. It really is. Uh-huh. My fucking brain is like taffy right now, and you guys are just three Amish teenagers yanking uh-huh. it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, one guest He's said, laughing. asked if they were in sleep paralysis. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. They was fell last asleep. Week. We were talking about how if you have uh, if you're Amish and you got like erectile dysfunction, it's pretty rough because most of your day is just yanking it, yanking to taffy. <laughs> you got no entertainment, no TV or nothing. You put up a Thank house. Thank God you, you got that you joke fuck out. fuck every day. <laughs> I'm not, this God. is not a joke. It's a true sto- uh, take. Yeah. I want to hear that. I want to take you story. to a fucking abandoned <laughs> lot and bury you up to your neck. Uh, you cover you your head take, in honey. You you oh, yeah. No, please you talk you over take it. all six inches? <laughs> Keep talking <laughs> over. You think you could take those whole six? Let's throw him in a well, dude. Let's throw him in a well and then pour concrete in it. He gets stuck. He's just so nervous whenever he hangs out with us. all six. We got it, dude. <laughs> we got it. God damn it. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, tell your story. I don't want to. I want to hear I don't it. want to do anything uh, good. I, I want to hear it. I want to hear it. Do you, you want to hear it? I want to hear the story. You're my only friend. Uh-huh. <laughs> this actually happens a lot. We got Bebop and Rocksteady over there. Uh-huh. Hey, uh-huh. I'm cool. Yeah. Whatever. Let's I, I did threaten clowns. to kill you. I'm sorry. That's okay. <laughs> Usually Bebop's not smaller than the other guy. Bebop. Is that an early hip-hop song? He's a fucking... Hippo that you're bigger than. He's not a hippo, stupid. <laughs> but, but we should make a Sam, song called Rhino. The Bebop. Sam, why are you being so serious? Why so serious? <laughs> uh huh. Did it say Sam at the end? Yeah. No. Oh, okay. Um, but <laughs> this is the case. Oh, oh wait, no, not that one. Um, <laughs> all right. Uh, tell the story. And here we go. <laughs> no, dude. That's the. That's the. That's the, that's the <laughs> That's you extending the olive branch. Uh, yeah, dude. I want to hear we about go. when you and were in an sto- office. <laughs> dude, <laughs> Jason, shut up. I want to tune you up so bad. God, do you want me to mute him for your story? Like no, no. <laughs> no, I like listening to Melton. Thanks, man. It's just good to see you step on someone else's punchlines. <laughs> <laughs> do you know? Bo- to my own. Do you know Bob Keen? No, of course not. No, that'd be a good painting of him. <laughs> This guy? guy? Yeah. No, yeah. this is our uh, <laughs> that guy? Uh-huh. Mm. Isn't that that guy who had a stroke and still does stand up? No, that's uh that's, that's Chris, Chris Damon. Damon. Chris, Chris Damon. Damon, yeah. Did he get that from eating pussy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. he was eating pu- he was eating <laughs> pussy at a stroke. He did. He was- <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah. He's, he's not drowning in pussy, but he's dying during sex. <laughs> Dude, this girl, you gotta appreciate that as a woman. Yeah. I was I was in town like immediately after that happened, and yeah. he was just like half a man on stage, uh, yeah. like, and I couldn't tell any difference because he was always so drunk. Yeah, as soon as he got out of the ICU, he hit the open mic. Yeah, he had to get to Coles yeah. to let everyone know what God's face looked like. <laughs> He's yeah. the Colton Burpo of Chicago comedy, dude. I love that episode of your podcast. I listened to that. Who's Colton oh, Burpo? Thanks, Colton Burpo was the boy who died and went to heaven and came back. 
<laughs> the boy who died a wolf? Is it Harry Potter? Right? The boy who tie died. <laughs> oh, tie died. He was trying to make a shirt to sell in front of the fish lot. Yeah, and then he yeah. came back. And all the all the fish fans <laughs> fucked him to death. Yeah. Because he was so pure. With, with helium. They called with, him uh, slurp with, him. Uh, uh -huh. With the balloons, you know those balloons, uh, whippets, whippets, yeah, yeah whippets. whippet uh, real good. I love whippets. Yeah, I, I you fan. have I love whippets written all over you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. You like to hang out in the tunnels and suck up. Yeah, cream cans. this looks kind of like a whippet, but also it looks more like a bullet. Well, this looks kind of like a whippet. Yeah, I'm this. just gonna copy you guys. Uh -huh. Can I do the copy game? How about this? Uh, this. Why don't you tell us a fucking copy. story about? I'm an not office. going to. <laughs> it was gonna be great, and it would have been actual comedic content. No, still, how about this? Jason pulls a muscle. How about this? I'm Sam Town. I wear short shorts. You can pull my muscle. I wear shorts. I'm just tall. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> no, God. so uh, how do you short? So you're married. I'm actually married too. But what um, to the game? No, you're I, married to the rapper. The game? No, I, no, I'm, <laughs> I'm married. And so you know how you see this epoxy table thing I did? I didn't. Know I've been what doing a lot of called. epoxy. Um, yeah. I'm kind of. In, uh, <laughs> I've been doing a lot of eat pussy. Epoxy moron. <laughs> they call me. But it was Chris uh, My wife uh, tried to leave me, <laughs> so I epoxied her in my closet in my room. So we're still technically married. That's good. We man. never got divorced. You got to keep it fresh in the bedroom. The doctor said that I I have Munchausen's epoxy, but. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God you got that one. Did out. you get that? Yeah, I got it. Yeah, let's hear, let's hear the story. No, <laughs> you guys had a shot. We can to... do this. I can play by your rules. I can do gaba gaba gooba. You know, <laughs> swim, scram, ding ding. Uh, 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 are you gonna blow your act on the pod? <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> No, I'm just going to do your stuff. You can do I want to take a picture with Melton last night, and I was like, does anyone have three cameras? <laughs> nice. Thanks, man. I do that every podcast. That's his joke. Uh, yeah. yeah, I know. Am yeah. I the biggest fantasy guy you've ever seen? No. This, is, I... so, this is my impression of so wrong. What about this? <laughs> Am I the biggest fantasy guy you've ever seen in your life? Am I the chubbiest behemoth you've ever seen? <laughs> do I got the littlest, tiniest penis? You should take him on the road since no. you, you're for the Chubby Chaser <laughs> podcast. No, dude. Truck. He opened for me in Dubuque at New Year's. Years one year oh, at the yeah. fucking comedy bar, the puke. Yeah, like. the puke. Yeah, they don't even celebrate their New Year's at the same time as us. That's bullshit. Whoa, Persians, Narose with the table with all the shit on. <laughs> oh, you're talking, about, <laughs> you're not talking about the puke. You're talking about, you're talking about Persians. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. He shouldn't be there. Yeah, that's cultural appropriation. That guy's Persian because he lies like a rug. <laughs> per per Persian <laughs> Persians love playing golf. They do. Yeah, yeah. Because mm -hmm. of the Persian they golf. They also love white mm -hmm. cars. <laughs> they do. Yeah. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And what happened at New Year's? Oh, he just did a bunch of crowd work and I hated it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's really funny. Oh, they also gave everyone noisemakers and they're like, don't use these until midnight. And immediately all the fucking mouth breathers in Dubuque were just yeah. wah, wah. Careful, mm -hmm. my family's from near Dubuque. Yeah, careful. Uh, for, actually, yeah. farm. My dad grew up on a farm, kind of like you. Well, yeah, I grew up on a pig farm because I'm a pig. Yeah. And I wall around in mud and I eat poop. Well, he yeah. knows. I think, <laughs> yeah, I, I think, poop. I think yeah, eat poop. Yeah. I, think, I, think, I think he knows the story better than you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, You've heard the term piggybacking. Mm -hmm. He got a bunch of pigs on his back to unlatch the gate. Yeah. <laughs> then he so went we to get Tokyo out and eat some <laughs> acorns. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And, and that, the that's, how I met, that's how I met you. Didn't that you, was the whole did, motivation for getting out is the acorns on the other side of the fence. Yeah. You're like, I hate all the ones on this side. And then you guys, you guys locked the family in the pig pen, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you guys had the house. That's and then you guys had uh, sex in the house. <laughs> yep, that's right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he cracked the code on Young Sam Talent. There I was, me and Aaron Naylor. Yeah, out Aaron. There in, yeah, in Pig Fuck Missouri. Mm -hmm. so trying to having pig fucks, and, mm -hmm. pig fucking. So, so what do you tell us all about your, all about your life and shit? Yeah, no. <laughs> what you, uh, what's no. What's going, what, going on in this office? Ideas? I heard about. <laughs> Dude, what's going on in the office? Because I'm I'm just waiting for you to fall asleep Let's so I can come. sit on your face. <laughs> you know, I watched the movie Interstellar. In I want to give you a CPAP <laughs> smear with Adam <laughs> Boughton. Mm. We watched the movie Interstellar in the office. And you know that's it. That's it. <laughs> Thank you, Dylan. You yeah. know his old podcast, RoboCop Two. This is RoboCop yeah. Eight. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's like it's like RoboCop Two, but more. This is like dread. Cause that's what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Call me the judge. Dreading this. They call me the judge. Hey. Here come the judge. Hey, I'm Adam Gilbert. Oh, nice. <laughs> you guys have that program? Uh -huh. Send yeah, yeah, yeah. Program Adam Gilbert. Yeah. No, Send him the hell. We have the Adam Gilbert program. <laughs> Welcome to Robocop 8. <laughs>
<laughs> Sometimes we send people to hell, like people that we don't like. Oh, no. Yeah, then, who do you not like? Who do you hate? Yeah, Jason you, Melton. All right, I'll send, <coughs> we'll send Jason yeah. to hell. So what no, happens? No, dude, we got to send someone who's is, someone, send name somebody. Adam Gilbert to no, hell. We, 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 who, who do you hate? I don't really hate anyone. Yeah, right. I don't. <laughs> That's I gay. don't live like you. I don't walk around just harboring resentments towards nice. people who slighted me. I like it. No, you don't. You're like, yeah. I'm all evolved. I don't eat meat. I don't drink anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Look at me on my fucking ivory castle. He's so, he's so house. sprightful. He's the he's most sprightful. Yeah. Right. Why you, I appreciate that sprightful. I don't have to list my resume. It makes me seem more humble. You know who I wish was here? <laughs> like the jungle. Jim. Jim. I love yeah. Jim. I wish Jim was you. Jim Weber? Jim uh, told me he missed me the other day. Jim. Jim, well, we- Jim who ate dinner off of a piece of wood. <laughs> 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 His plate was like a two by four. Yeah. For a while. <laughs> Who? Jim, my, this is my old roommate. Yeah. My Jim. old best friend. <laughs> yeah. Uh, from Hammond. Yeah, Jim would always be like, what a wild man. Do night you know what used had. to be called just Mund and then Sam visited Hammond? Oh. <laughs> you wanted to say where you got that joke? <laughs> I made it up in my head. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You know that one train used to be called the Amtrak, now it's called the Hamtrak. Yeah. So, yeah. Outside right Detroit when you went there. Uh, yeah. It you, was just called Tram after you. Ham Tramic. Yeah. And the track you came in on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's where right. Trixie's bar is. Ham Tramming. <laughs> Sam Tramming. Got yeah. derailed. It was really and sad. And that's what he did. He dressed as a woman and he trixied all the boys in the bathroom. Did, yeah. Anyway, so. <laughs> I've been tricking fellas left and right, man. It's Renaissance. So, man. so what happens? <laughs> Renaissance hand. What happens is. Uh, if, so, if you're tricking them, I blame them. I don't mean to victim blame, but. I look good in a dress, and they're not victims. <laughs> No. They're customers. <laughs> so uh, Jason is uh, right. being really annoying and talking over Sam. So Sam shoots him with a machine gun, uh-huh. and then he dies, uh-huh. and then he goes to hell. Uh-huh. Wait, and then I kill Satan and I become the Lord of Hell. Yeah, you kill Satan. Yeah, kill Satan. Uh huh. Who gave you that night? Let's talk about Lucifer. Yeah. I always got that thing on me. Who gave you that? They hell. call me Reese because I always got the peace. Welcome to hell, pussy. You're here for being annoying and spiteful, bitch. Whatever, at least I'm not gay like everyone else here. No, yeah, you are. That's also why I can't here. wait to see all my That's friends from the podcast because they're all gay. You're also here because you're gay. Just so you know. And I think uh, Sam is trans. Also no, he's not. He, he's not hey, I know Sam's going to be in hell. You know why? Because it's Adam and Eve, not Adam and Feet. And, uh, <laughs> um, what? <laughs> yeah, he's going to go to hell for his foot fetish. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it is wrong. <laughs> God who, awful. Who, who gave it's you that? John Dick Winters? <laughs> I, I wrote that, man. <laughs> no, that on, a, on a YouTube comment. Oh, this is mine. Big laughs. Yeah. Where's, where's Stephen Hofstetter? <laughs> Where's Stephen Hofstetter? Yeah, I'm really <laughs> cashing a check. Uh, probably doing fake crowd work. Can I have a likely. funny voice? Um, it, it only, only works, works on, on this mic. one. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Same one. Oh, you're my hey, mic. it's the cancel police. <laughs> <laughs> this is my knife. Jason Why don't you try and have a more positive attitude, Sam? I do. It's HIV positive. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like I'm dying in here. <laughs> Slowly. Look I'm, I'm dying in here. Hey, look at me. No I'm Jason knows. Melton. <laughs> I'm from near Gary, Indiana. I ate a bunch of smelting products when I was a kid. <laughs> and now I hang out and date black people. I got mad. <laughs> uh-huh. you, you, you saying you gotta be uh, are you, uh, saying you gotta he... be mentally fucked up to date black people? Hey, listen <laughs> to me. Listen to me, I'm Melton. You're doing Dale McPeak's voice. Yeah. <laughs> is this how I talk or is With this how lisp. Melton talk? <laughs> Dale McPeak's so, so fucked up. He's so fucked up, he's with smelting. What is this one? I don't even know. So it's yeah. yeah. so yeah. yeah. smells. Can I get a smelting salt? Oh, do you like when someone yeah. talks Less over you? comedy office. Salt love. Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Th- this is the office. This is the new the office. When Jason does comedy, I call it comedy because it's crap. You. It's crap yeah. comedy. Yeah, and it's <laughs> booked by Ian Douglas Terry. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever happened to that guy? I think they got him. <laughs> I think the cancel police found Ooh, out. I've never been yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I just knew Dave Lasso hated him. <laughs> Fucking God, uh, <laughs> yeah, we got him. <laughs> We're the cancel police. Hey, everybody, uh, get down on your knees. This is the cancel police. We're going to come arrest you all for being too offensive. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even Douglas conforming. Terry teach himself how to read? Oh, wait, that was Frederick Douglas Terry. Yeah, Frederick Douglas. I know him. My bad. He's that black guy, right? Yeah. What about yeah. Fre- I look like Fre- Frederick Douglass a little bit. <laughs> yeah. You know yeah, shit? you do. <laughs> what about? You look like French Fry Douglas. <laughs> 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 the guy who eats all the fries on Douglas Avenue. What about, what about Franklin yeah. Helena Roosevelt? Sure. He, he's in hell. That counts. 
Actually, he's probably not because he didn't drop the the nukes. You look like uh, you look like somebody dropped King Kong Bundy in hair. <laughs> <laughs> I am egg shaped. <laughs> yeah, dude. That King man Kong is notoriously awesome. egg shaped. Yeah, he's the eggiest man I've ever seen. Yeah. So was Humpty Dumpty. He was actually a real egg. He was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's sad what happened That's true. He's probably the most egg shaped of all people that I know. <laughs> Your butthole's about to be peg shaped when I'm done. Oh, oh, uh oh. Would you peg me? I What's can't figure out how to that? close this. Um, oh, yeah. You gotta hit the it's thing. It's tricky for people who are dumb. When you need a new closure. I know. I'm <laughs> self admitted, self identified dumb. <laughs> it's on the. It's on, on this don't part. Don't touch that one. It's on this part. Put it down. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Walked right into that. <laughs> And he's a knife guy. Uh, we call him Fat R- uh, Fat Knife. Yeah, you know Matt Rife. He's yeah. Fat Knife. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't Check like it out. I'm wearing the same shirt him. as that guy. Uh, <laughs> holy shit. <laughs> yes, this is... Uh, <laughs> Where Cancel do you find please. that? The shaved ape clothing outlet? <laughs> Actually, yeah, I gave it to him. It That's big, nice. It was a present. <laughs> Too big. Uh-huh. Oh, Dylan, I got gifts for you. Whoa! Yeah, wait, you wait. Open, open up the thing. Fuck. I got you... Uh, you got yeah. this, Dylan. Yeah, we can talk in the meantime. There's two things I think that. Tr- oh, yeah. oh, be Mac, careful about the camera. But I what are the things? go in there. They're like up. It's, me and Mac it's, are it's rich. Two, two items of clothing. Did you notice them? Me and Mac are rich. Really? Yeah. In friendship. I'm no. Not putting yeah. it on in money. Dude. How do you I, think I got? He told me he's rich right away. How do you think yeah, I got good. a real bullet? Good. I just want you to drink water out of. Yeah. What is that? An M69? No. This is your artillery round. Whoa. Yeah. And this is. An art, art artery round. <laughs> this is art. That's, yeah. That's, yeah. And that's a bad artery. <laughs> <laughs> that was a joke he just made. <laughs> do you guys just do all the same jokes every episode? No, no, no. no, no. no. I'm saying he's going to have heart problems because he's big and fat. Yeah, yeah. Did You said art retarded. I said something, and then someone else said something else. No, no you said... Now he, Dylan's back. Oh, nice. Do you have a... Do you have a Oh wait, that one is broken. So. My my Dylan's back, and you're going to be in trouble. <laughs> is it is that one of these that you're smoking? Is that one of these? Yeah, Dude, nice. Cool. Yeah, I didn't know. Cheers, cheers, man. Everyone used to smoke cigs and drink, and you were bearable. Yeah, Those were the days. yeah, yeah. I was yeah. addicted to cigs, and I I changed my ways. Now I'm nah, nah, way more addicted to nicotine thing. than I ever have been. Yeah, I know. Um, it's still good. So. When you wanted to kill me, let's walk walk me through that. Mm. Yeah, how are you going to kill it? Uh, I was going to shoot. I was going to shoot you right with a gun. Next time you yeah, with, a, with, a, with a harpoon, I'm with guessing. My, no, with, <laughs> with my gun. Yeah, <laughs> this, oh, is, this nice. is a real gun. Cool. Well, yeah, but we also we, we ordered a, we ordered a special gun at Al- nothing in there, nothing in the chamber. Yeah, thank you. We wanted to kill you with a regular the gun, bullet. but it's not going to work because you're too big. <laughs> it's really hard to come up with rebuttals to the exact same joke over and over again. Yeah, dude. Well, why don't you lose some weight? I can't. <laughs> I'm having a hard time. When I, I was struggle. a kid, my parents said, just tell your bullies that they're ugly and you can lose weight and then they'll be ugly forever. Yeah. Then they lose. went through puberty and got hot and I never lost weight. That was the last time your dad ever talked to you? Yeah, we well, never was, touched. Like, I'm running away with Jim's mom. Last time me and my dad touched, I was a sperm leaving his dick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your dad's distant, right? <laughs> 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 he doesn't. He doesn't care for you. Why don't, why don't we yeah, talk about that? Let's yeah. get into. He that. lives about an hour away. Let's yeah. get into that. Never see him. Let's get into your relationship. With your dad. All your, it seems like all your siblings moved as far away for, as possible from you as they could. Well, they all moved. We all kind of did our own thing. Yeah, you went an hour away from home. Yeah, because you keep waiting for your dad to show up and be I'm, like, "Come you, on, ride in the back of the pickup." <laughs> you, you, you thought you were gonna be like the star. I've been in the back of a pickup. Okay. You thought yeah. you'd be the star child, like the star comedian. <laughs> now you're just sprightful. <laughs> No, dude, I jumped. I uh, w- I was the star child. My parents always tell me I'm their favorite, and then they give me extra gifts. Maybe because you're you ga- fucking losers. You're gay like David Bowie. <laughs> you guys are probably your least thing. favorite kids. So you're an only child. I'm star not. child is a. <laughs> you're you're you are my book. The only male child. You're a fat version of David Bowie. It's your st- star child. The only whale child. Because you're gay. He's Goliath Bowie. Yeah. Was it? Didn't David Bowie and Mick Jagger have sex? Probably. Yeah. Kind of like him and the Dairy Queen hooked up. <laughs> <laughs> you're kind of like a rock star on stage. You're like David Blowhole. You're kind of like a dying star on stage because you're so dense that you suck things into you. <laughs> and he's a dying. And he, but he was never a star. He's never a star. <laughs> yeah, no. yeah, you're a dying middle. It sounds like I'm not really a dying star then. No, because I was never a star. And I don't know what it means to be 
sucking things into me. <laughs> You're a dying dwarf super, planet. Super I'm like Nova. a dying star at the buffet. <laughs> I'd be sucking things. You're, you're kind of like you're just kind of start. You're kind of like the planet Pluto. Like everyone forgot about you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, just like the planet Pluto. Yeah. Same size. Unbookable in Chicago. Uh oh. J- Jason doesn't like that. Wow. I'm, I'm, team, that I'm teaming up with Sam. I guess. Yeah, you guys. Because <laughs> normally it's me and him teaming up against. I get it, Mac. <laughs> you're like one of them little fish that clean the sharks. Uh oh. You got to team up with somebody fish. like big and fat to hang out with. Yeah. You're the baby bird, and I'm the hippo, and you're cleaning my teeth. <laughs> yeah, that one. <laughs> you're like a Picostomus. And you're, like, I'm, you're like a twice baked Potatomus. I'm Picostomus Prime. <laughs> This is a, oh, a twice baked potato. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's pretty good. Yeah, it's Damn, not, oh, dude. mine was too much. No, I just had to repeat it so I could understand it. Oh. <laughs> Here come to I judge. Mean, you really are a genius. <laughs> a twice baked potato. Yeah, that's that's uh, something that that's Stephen, only Stephen Hawking could come up. With. Your catchphrase was "Here come to fudge," and then you'd eat it all. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What shows? My catchphrases leave me alone. Actually, what shows yeah. in town were you doing or are you doing? Did you do Humble Jungle again? Uh, yeah, I did Humble Jungle last yesterday. Yeah. yeah. Welcome. This is the humble hustle. Yeah, this is the humble hustle. Uh-huh. And hum- yeah. we're actually kind of in humbled also. So humble I know. hustle, humble. So yeah. When you uh, want... Jason begged me to come on here, he said mm. we're really close to humble jungle. Uh-huh. Mr. <laughs> we are, Mr. Talent. You can come through. I was giving yeah. you a sense of direction because I'm trying to be helpful. Shout out to friend. shout out to Nathan w- Nathan Weil Nathan Wheel, my boy, who owns that that house. Yeah. He's a good dude. Yeah. Jewish. That guy's cool. Jewish, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. That's pretty cool. They kicked yeah. out the guy with the red hat last night, and then the guy Jewish just came back. Right the guy took the, the hat, hat off, and everyone was like, oh, a new cool guy is here. <laughs> it was it an MC Lightsy? No. Was it, was it Brian Redband? I had no idea who this guy was. <laughs> it was some dude wearing a plum bowler hat, and we didn't really clock that he was going to be a problem at all. And then... You would think it'd be Brian. No, I did. He immediately was like, I have fucking rape and murder charges. I was being facetious. <laughs> Oh, oh, look, guys... I have one of those cool vocal tonalizers on. <laughs> look, it's me. He does. Yeah, I'm I was the a, devil, was, the body was, Ventura. I was able to get it onto his mic. Yes, the, thank uh... you for hooking me up. <laughs> it's a pleasure to be here, <laughs> boys. You're pirate boys. I'm pirate, the body Ventura. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome aboard, me ship of ghouls. No, but um, goblins, you... grody spiders. That must have been Brian Redband because he had a red hat on, and he, got, ba- and he got banned. Brian <laughs> Red. <laughs> Stuck. <laughs> Brian Red Sky at Night. <laughs> Brian Red Sailor's Band Delight. The... Brian, your Bane voice. Brian Redbeard. Brian Redburn. I'm, I'm Bane. What is it? That's not it. I'm, I'm, uh, I was born I'm, on the... I was born on the. I, w- do- I, I was, was born on the do not book list. I'm banned from every show. Uh-huh. I'm banned from the Lincoln Lodge. I can't perform in front of four people. So it's kind of making fun I of was, the fact that he's banned. I was born in the toilet. <laughs> it's me, Jason Melton. <laughs> Jason, more turds wow, in like my mouth than a toilet it. bowl. <laughs> I have sunglasses without arms on them. Mm-hmm. Oh, that arms. Yeah, that's right. Mm-hmm. No arms. I ain't got no arms behind me. It's a peg. It's a peg leg sunglass. I'm. I'm out of the state, huh? It's me, peg leggy hill. That's pretty cool, right? <laughs> yeah, that is kind of cool. I'm married to Hank Hill. The, if you think your sunglasses need arms, you are living in the Matrix. If your sunglasses need arms, <laughs> you a dumb motherfucker. <laughs> nice. Mm-hmm. Oh, we we were doing Jamie Fox worthy. Uh-huh. <laughs> and everyone he thinks that everyone cool thinks that, that, he, that he's dead. Jamie Fox uh-huh. is he dead? Well, people think he that. was in the hospital. He was or yeah, something. but he, like, he hasn't like been sh- like shown anywhere. So oh, no. people think that he's like uh, he was dead, but not saying anything. Shit. So Jamie Fox worthy's like, um, what was the beginning of it? He's like, you might be a redneck. <laughs> he's like. Um, if you, you cool. if you if uh, you were in a coma and people haven't seen you for a long time, <laughs> you might you might be a dead guy. Uh, if you're in slow jam. Uh, That's a uh, Jamie Fox. Uh-huh. If you sing that, you might be a cool black guy. Yeah, <laughs> smoky <laughs> sausages are what you have for breakfast and dinner. Smoky. Uh-huh. Do you guys know Smokey Robinson came out to do an album called Gasms? <laughs> no, it's what? Probably not even joking. Who told no. you that? Your girlfriends. I mean, what? <laughs> nice. More than one? Yeah. I came out with the orgs. It's, it's an album called Orgs. These beautiful black queens. Orgs. Yeah. Org. Yeah. It's like, I, 
If a long time ago, I would do a podcast called Hardest Gas, and it would be about your hardest orgasm you ever had. I'd interview different people. It was when I saw the sunrise twice in one day. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I, saw I, this, I, saw I was this, in the crow's nest, and I blew a load. I saw this Craigslist <laughs> ad for an orgy. Yeah. I got there. Go it turned, on. It turned out it was just a corgi. Just, yeah. I, I, so I left. At least I didn't sign up for this. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Yeah. You How am I going to fuck this dog? Yeah. <laughs> no one here to watch. I, don't fuck, I don't fuck dogs. No, you're not insane. We're actually we're doing a do dog charity right now. Yeah. So we're, we're taking money from orphanages and giving it to jo- dog charities. Yeah. yeah. My dog Jason, charities. We're feeding Chinese children to dogs. <laughs> it's good. It was revenge. It's kind of reparations. <laughs> we, we, did, we did think, we did think of a good idea. <laughs> so you know you didn't. You, you, know, you know how Pounds like put down like dogs? I know about Pounds. Pounds. Look at him. Uh-huh. He's packing <laughs> them on over there. Uh-huh. No, but Pounds put down yeah. dogs and cats that have been there for too long. Mm-hmm. We've been thinking about uh, instead of just like putting them down and throwing them away, we can can them up in the food, sell the food to China. And then that way, we're not just the consumers; we're also uh, we're uh, producers. Yeah. yeah, so we have the production. I'd be there. willing to trade it for more jewelry. And then, and then, so if there were <laughs> sanctions, then they'd be fucked. They wouldn't have any food. They wouldn't have any of our money from the cool shit we buy from them, mm-hmm. like like this big bullet yep. from China. They, they I'm so probably fucked. actually dismantling their military by buying this from them. I had an idea for it was like I took on a Shark Tank and they laughed at me off. What was it? It was a ball pit bull. And put a dog in a McDonald's place. <laughs> oh, they did not like that. They hated that uh, idea. I have a, I have Mark an idea. Cuban said, uh, "Fuck you." Yeah, the fuck does he know? The ball pit. <laughs> uh, Cuban, my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Not Cuban, I don't think. <laughs> you've been, you've, been, you've been on Shark Tank a lot of times. Yeah. yeah. Do you remember when I was on there? I think they're there? just making fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I keep inviting you back to so laugh you out of the room. No, yeah. <laughs> when, when Jason went on, they changed it to Whale Tank. I, my other idea was the, the dog rape whistle. <laughs> so yeah. It's a whistle that yeah, only people being it. raped can hear. Right. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> <laughs> Here, Dylan, hold this device real quick. Beep, 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 beep. What does that mean? Beep, 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 it's a chode detector. I've been listening to Lil Wayne too much. What did you do on Shark Tank? I wish I could get one of those. I was the tank. Yeah, no, he filled me with sharks. He said, no one heard it, but he said, when Jason's on, it's a whale tank. Yeah. Aww. Yeah. I went to the casino. They said, oh, we got a whale on our hands. I was like, I haven't even played any games yet. Uh-huh. That's the third time you've done that joke <laughs> in a different way. <laughs> I didn't know if I did it that way. That shirt went straight to your gut. Uh-huh. It was yeah. showing his gut. I want to cut those Every buttons off you. Go ahead. I want to cut those buttons off you so bad. I'm never wearing this shirt again. I'm retiring it after today. Hey, yeah. why? <clears throat> All right, I'll wear it again. I, get, I, get, I gave it to you so you'd wear it. It's a really cool shirt. <laughs> yeah. You look cool. Spades and Thanks, interesting. Man. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, do everyone, I feel cool. Everyone in the casino <laughs> would think you're so cool. Like, if you went to Vegas and were wearing that. Hell yeah. Mm-hmm. They would yeah. think, like, you're uh, like the master of playing cards, not like a tourist or anything. Yeah, they'd be like, look at the royal those are the people flush. to get in with. Because he was born yeah. in the toilet. <laughs> casino people. He was, boy, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. It was amazing. You should, you should just move to, like, upstate Wisconsin and just be, like, a casino guy. Ooh. Uh-huh. Potawatomi. Yeah, Potawatomi. Uh-huh. Manitowoc. Potawatomi. You. Uh-huh. Potawatomi. Yeah. Us. Potawatomi. They. Smoke them. your six your, your uh-huh. fake cigarettes in there. Potawatomi. They. Them. Yeah, yeah, Potawana. yeah. Potawatomi. Potawatomi. They. Uh, them. Eat. Potawatomi. Eat. Tic Tac uh-huh. Paddywhack. Potawatomi. Whoa, uh-huh. it says written on here only for babies. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, Do fa- not consume if you're a big boy. What about uh-huh. fat babies? Yeah. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. So, doesn't say there's no weight. There's no weight thing. It just says four babies only. So it makes sense you smoke. Yeah, you probably want them now. I do. I'm not a baby. For babies. No, I'm not a baby. <laughs> That's babies. what sucks. So you immediately just think it's for you. He eats babies. Because you're kind of you're selfish. <laughs> <laughs> that could be our prank scene. Would be we'd have babies here and people would eat them and then we could uh, blackmail them after. You ever get worried that your children are going to team up and get, escape from inside of you with Zeus? Uh-huh. He's referring to the Titan Cronus from Greek yeah. mythology. Yeah, no, I know. Yeah, <laughs> I understand. Mac knows all about yeah. Cronus. They said you eat babies. I don't yeah. know. I heard what happened to Cronus. I got worried about yes. you. Mm-hmm. So, I'm, actually, I'm more of Saturn. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. 
But more, some would uh, say fat urn. Fat urn, okay. Yeah. Um, and they're going to need a big fat urn to hold your ashes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if you, if you think about it, Crohn's like uh, Crone is your very act. similar to Crohn's disease. Because uh -huh. with Crohn's, your body attacks itself from the inside. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. Just like the kids attacked him from the inside. That's why mm -hmm. it's called that, man. So I'm going to get a Cronus tattoo. Cronus was the god of yeah. bloody stool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Every so. time I sit on a stool... Mm -hmm. I wreck it. You like well, you the... sit, it's upside down. Jason actually broke one of my chairs today. <laughs> Ow. I did. He Doing an act out? How, do you, how do you think I broke <laughs> no, it? No, he dude. just literally said How do you it. break chairs? It I know what you do. <laughs> I've never broke a chair. In your life? Uh-uh. I Sorry. break chairs all the time. Uh-uh. You know what I, I do? I broke my girl's couch. You even yeah. broke as many chairs as Sora has. Yeah, he's he's he uh, he has like twenty reels about him talking about he it. So it must have been it must have been twenty different times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's only the honest thing to do as a comedian. You can only repeat a joke if it happens again. <laughs> I, I like how he refuses to use his hands to touch that. Like there's anthrax in there. I'm trying to figure out how to get these out of here using the knife. Mm -hmm. It's really hard. You know they call me Mac the knife. Yeah, they do. Mm -hmm. They call me. I remember Fat when Mac the knife. tried to close yeah, they, yeah, they call the knife. You Fat knife. They call you McDonald's the wipe. Because you go to McDonald's and you get the wrappers, then you wipe with them and then you eat them. Uh -huh. <laughs> I eat the wrappers. <laughs> you eat the wrappers that are covered in your own poop. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. All right. She loves wrap. <laughs> I'm yeah. a I'm a rapper. I like to use Reynolds wrap, which are the official condoms of Burt Reynolds. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I always thought it I was thought Ryan never, Reynolds. I, I figure you get you don't seem like a guy who has a lot of leftovers. I never <laughs> used a condom in my life. I got the in your in your, in your Matt Rife. Yeah, yeah, Matt Rife, man. I haven't, I haven't used any condoms on, with Matt Rife. <laughs> I wish I had a Matt Rifle right now to blow your heads off. Not you, nice. Dylan. You'd be safe. Thank he actually you. stole it from me. I said that on a different podcast. Oh, yeah. yeah. As a listener. I, I, <laughs> Not. Yeah. Um, no, I had said I'm I'm Matt Rife's brother, Matt Rifle. And if people keep talking shit about Matt Rife, you guys are all going down. Yeah. We're pro Matt Rife. Yeah. yeah. The guy's hot. Yeah. And, and he's also very funny. Yeah. Uh huh. And he's Chinese. And if he yeah, looked he, different, he, he it would tell work. joke. Huh? If, if he looked different, it would definitely still work the same, right? Yeah. That's why I love when someone, if you change how they look, then their bit would still totally work. I think comedy should only be prepared crowd work. <laughs> yeah. It's a Sam good move. Perry. So does Sam. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm a massive fan of crowd work. I'm always like, oh my I god, like they just came up with that on the spot. Yeah, <laughs> I like it when a black guy goes on stage and goes, "Hello, white people," uh -huh. <laughs> or even better, <laughs> look, oh, at look the... a black guy. Uh -huh. That's another good one. Look, at all, good one. look uh -huh. at all these damn white people. <laughs> That's my opener, uh -huh. actually. Yeah, you I point change... to the one black guy. <laughs> oh, look a black guy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, here's there. my thing. I would, I would never say the n word. No, I never would. What if you're really you mad? seen black people? They're scary. <laughs> I don't want to get beat up. Yeah, yeah. The, the Spice Girl's named Scary Spice, the black one. Yeah, yeah. No one's <laughs> made that observation before. <laughs> I think it's okay to say that word if you're really mad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If you, you know, you yeah. have a good reason. Yeah. <laughs> only, only, only one person can make an observation, by the way, Sam. Why don't you like this? Every man has its price. <laughs> it's not, well, there's a hole in it. It's like not going to smoke right. Like this and see what happens. Uh -huh. <laughs> that would be cool give if me, you smoked that like that. Yeah, here you go. I've never seen That would be pretty ever, cool. Did you invent that you, just you, now? You might be the coolest guest. Because that is like fucking <laughs> cool, dude. Gorilla over here. <laughs> that should be in a fucking movie. We've, hey, look. We smoke, smoke fake cigarettes off a knife. Big uh -huh. deal. We've this had some pretty cool guests on, like Harold Patrick. Yeah. Who have you had? Harold Patrick. What if he got addicted to smoking him like that? Um, Who's Harold Patrick? He's this guy. He looks he's, like a Muppet. He's old enough to have sex with, but he looks like he's not. Yeah, uh -huh. he looks really young. He's and, a pedophile. And, and he carries a gun when he goes out. Yeah, we're actually going to try because to use of all him the pedophiles the, trying to. Uh, I don't carry my gun when I go out because I get too drunk down. when I go out. You yeah. know, <laughs> he should probably be afraid of birds coming to get him if he's very small. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He he actually is. He looks like a <laughs> lizard, and when his dick breaks off, it grows back. Your dick looks like a Twizzler because kids want to eat it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he lets him too. I left it outside a lot, so, so it got pretty him, gnarled. <laughs> giving candy to a baby, he says. So look at that. <laughs> you are cool. 
No, but we've been thinking about setting up a guest with a blackmail thing, like an Epstein type of thing. So, like, we'll have Harold Patrick because he looks like a little kid. Uh We'll have him, like, come out of the closet here uh, with uh, duct tape, completely nude. No, no, no. He's wearing like a kid's, like, sailor outfit. You know, like, little kids with a sailor outfit. And, like, a big lollipop. And he's sitting on the guest's lap. And then you should, yeah. And then we get all the pictures. We do it. We call him Epstein. You're a 16 year old girl. It's our show idea, Prankstein. All right, Harold, come on out. <laughs> if that happened, you'd have to put a blood pressure cuff around Melton's dick and then uh-huh. see how throbbing it got. <laughs> and a little boy came out that he knew that he could bang up. He does Holy like, shit, my dick's got 120 beats per minute right now. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> Looks like a feeder mouse. Yeah, I have, <laughs> it's like a, it's like a power violence. Bro. I have an apple watch on my dick. Whoa, I yeah. have an apple for a dick. Really? Yeah, that's why you have an apple dick? in their mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so Jason's constantly. <laughs> you put an apple in your dick and your mouth? But hit this cigarette real what quick. What kind of apples would pigs? we be, guys? Let's do what kind of apples? Macintosh. I like Macintosh. Nice. Yeah. If we were to be a type of apple, I'd uh-huh. be Macintosh. You'd be fat, fat, fat apple. Uh-huh, right. I'd be a computer. Computer apple. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mac, <laughs> Macintosh. <laughs> what would you be? Pear, I was gonna, a, a pear? I'm not a fucking pear. I'll I'll be a pear. I have a pear. It's uh, you're a Macintosh. My button, his face. <laughs> oh, oh, I like nice. that. That's a good one. I have a good. I have a good nice pear. Nice one, Beavis. Uh, I'd be Gilbert Grape. The 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 fruit. Actually, I would be uh, <laughs> the fruit. The pear. Yeah. Peach. I got a pear. It's also the fruit. I'd want to be a plantain. <laughs> what about this, James and the plantain. giant pear? Whoa, that would work. Yeah. James and the giant yeah. pear. That's a, <laughs> this is a book idea for so James in a giant pair of cans. <laughs> and he gets to hang out with them. <laughs> no, that would rock. That's a good idea. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, I've been I've been uh, pondering this one for years, trying to uh, pitch it to you because you write books. Uh-huh. So like uh, James and the giant pair. Uh-huh. I got an idea. How about and it's kind of like James and the giant peach, but it's a pair instead. I assumed it's apparent that that would never sell. I got one. Is me and you hanging and out? I, it's called Jason and the Giant Sam. <laughs> <laughs> it must be so nice to have a bigger man around. It is nice. Because you're usually oh, like the big, the big um, sweaty you, body dude, in town. The, the I know it's not easy. We got to pay extra for extra cows when we get a leather jacket. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had a leather jacket. Yeah, it's yeah, too exactly. expensive. I know. <laughs> I don't want to have to mortgage my home. I don't have to sell my boat. <laughs> Plus, I feel guilty about how many cows they got to skin. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Current, I'm work, uh, trying to get a mortgage on a bouncy castle right now, so <laughs> fingers crossed. They don't have leather jackets where I shop at the tent store uh-huh. for my clothes. I have to go to the awning manufacturer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, I'm all iry. I'm lost in the clouds. Uh-huh. Yeah. There's some, uh, what's when you did the CBD? Chicago Theater, did you take one of those curtains to use? as a bathrobe oh yeah baby <laughs> i laid it down and rolled myself up in it i was the velvet burrito <laughs> uh-huh. i said bring in some red chili so rob <laughs> that's kind of like because i wasn't sure what kind of guy he was <laughs> and i thought he could give me some red chili <laughs> so he showed up with some delicious biryani rice mm-hmm. yummy uh all, like all, it- all of so rob's friends like sell people uh likes for their instagram reels <laughs> 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 I love Sir Rob. Yeah, me too. Yeah. I love Indian culture. <laughs> I love not curries. Even, yeah, right. I'm not even Indian on that. On that I love uh, <laughs> when my cat attacks their forehead. Oh, man, it sucks. Because <laughs> I love lasers. Yeah. yeah. I knew that about you. Uh, yeah. I love lasers. I looked at you. I said, this guy loves he lasers. He does love electricity. But only when there's an even number. Mm-hmm. Uh, no, great, it's odd numbers. His grandpa gave Sorry. him a book, a, okay. a boy's book of electricity, is that right? Yeah, and you guys should look at uh, text messages we've had, and just pretty much all the texts are going to have an odd number of words there. So Is that actually yeah. true? Yeah, you should check it out. Jason, check it out. <laughs> I should check right now. That's fucked up. So how long does it so you like delete stuff and add now. stuff in? Huh? So you'll delete like letters. Yeah, I have to a lot make of sure. tricks to kind of you know words I can add in or to suffice your autism yeah, and if uh-huh. an abbreviation instead or undo it and that's normal. I'm autistic. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know He's that you, autistic. So he never he never knew he was autistic. That was the joke. Right? I, did, I was making sure. It's not I could a joke, hear. though. He, no, he thought growing up he was artistic, but he's from Boston. His his doctor said you're autistic, uh-huh. pal. So he went to art school thing. and started doing comedy as it's an art. Yeah. And uh-huh. then uh, he went to a doctor here and they said, no, you're autistic. Yeah. Like, Fuck. They go, this idiot. isn't. Because you're so cute. Uh-huh. Yeah. This isn't He's, an uh, artistic school. <laughs> they go, this is a, in an art school. It's an R word school. 
<laughs> which is a whole different. I guess it is an art in a way. It says on the it says on the outside though. of it, our words <laughs> smoke it the right way if you're gonna smoke yeah. it. It says, it says our, our that? Cool. Custom made by Jason Melton. That's huge. I didn't, well, he he didn't make it. it. I bought it. Look at this. That is huge. Well, that is huge. Look at this. See, we're rich. We buy comedy. each other knives and shit. What's you that? want a knife? This is bad boy of comedy. Yeah, I would like a knife. I'll get you one. Why don't you? I don't know. What do I have to lose? Yeah, you, you can cut pieces of ham off yourself and eat it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a it's a good diet because you don't gain weight because you're eating your own weight. Yeah. Have you ever heard about Break even. sustainable uh, when he got his ribs removed? Yeah, did you hear about that? To suck a bunch of other guys' dicks? Well, <laughs> I saw. Think, I heard Marilyn think. Manson got his rib removed to suck his own dick. But I went in there and they said, because you're so big and fat, you have to get all your ribs removed. And because your dick's small. And my dick's small. And because, yes, of course. But mm. then once I got all the ribs removed, I'm a big fat guy. I just wanted to eat the ribs, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I was not interested in sucking my dick. There was no spare ribs because yeah. you ate them all. And they got the special hospital barbecue sauce. It's called Typo. Mm. Yeah. Negative. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's, I, it's cold. I, they I eat it sound cold. like the singer of Typo Negative. <laughs> What's our sound? <laughs> is that your Dave Lasso impression? This is type of negative voice. What is this? A Chris Higgins podcast now? <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> is that how he sounds? They yes. do. They do. They do, they do uh, accents like, like that a lot. Yeah. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I like Chris Piggins. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like Chris Figgins. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Fig, I need a whole a fig, fig right Chris now. Fig Newton. Yeah. Yeah. Chris New- Newton's first love. <laughs> <The> real- nice, guys. <laughs> Give me a fig, Newton. <laughs> uh, are all these people on these posters former guests? Former. So these are album recordings that I've gone to, and uh, they've been on the pod. These are our best friends. No way for that was nice CBD of you to yeah, support uh, your friends. Yeah. Well, uh, that's the wall of fame. If you have a special coming up, and I go to it, then you'll be right there. Oh, yeah, that'd be huge. Don't you always record a special and then not release it? <laughs> yeah, because I have a commitment to craft. I just don't know if you'll fit macaroni in. and cheese. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, hey, uh, if you got some cheese, we got some shells right there. This guy loves pasta. Hey. He eats it religiously. So pasta thing. I do. I only eat pasta Hold when on. facing west towards Mecca. A lot of crafts, oh. macaroni and cheese. <laughs> so it's kind of a ritual. Um. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I do want to put you on that wall, but I don't know if you'll fit in the frame. Yeah, <laughs> I won't. We're yeah. actually putting in another wall for you. <laughs> That's good. So you had the roof removed so I could come in. <laughs> we, we could, to, we could, yeah, we could do a big one of him on the ceiling. I we, could, yeah. We ordered some extra cameras <laughs> <laughs> to take pictures of you. <laughs> That's what you look like. What do I look like? That I just stabbed a hole in you. Oh, you look too good to me. Yeah, trust me, I got, I got if enough I, holes that was already. My coffee, I got. <laughs> what hole you, you got? That? I got the eyes, the ears, nose, penis, butt. hole, butt, mouth. Cloaca. In that order. You have an egg laying pussy. Penis. Yeah, he does right? he does lay <laughs> eggs. On stage. Whatever. He's like, hey, BFW. <laughs> he is a secret. Laugh egg at this. Thing. At least I make something useful. You guys just produce shitty sperm. He's just like, no, oh. I'm the golden goose, dude. <laughs> uh-huh. But it's sperm, but it's golden sperm. Yeah. Dude, if you had eggs come He's, out of your body, <laughs> I would watch. <laughs> yeah. I would watch that live. You, you know we're sponsored by a sperm company? <laughs> Sounds painful. No. It's called Frida Fertility, and they give you the best sperm in the world. Uh-huh. Whoa. Yeah. That's it improves great. your sperm structure. Yes, uh-huh. your sperm structure, uh, the amount of sperm. Um, yeah. So if you want to have a baby, I can, get, I can give you some. I got some free samples. Yeah, you don't have to put any kind of like thickening uh, agents in your smoothies uh-huh. in the morning. Yeah, yeah no, yeah, it, it's all in one pill. Yeah. That's right. Thirty day supply, like nineteen ninety nine. You I don't like them. agents. This guy hates agents. I'm getting really worried about that ash that you have on there. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, oh, you hate uh, ash, huh? Yeah, ash ketchup. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, he's more of a mystery. I though. had a rash for like three months. Yeah, Everybody, everybody was calling me rash ketchup. Yeah, yeah. And I don't know why they were being so rash. Yeah, it's rash ridiculous of them. I it agree. is totally ridiculous. Someone <laughs> called me Rash Bandicoot, and I was like, this is just bullying. <laughs> yeah. That's really irrational because he gets rash. It was, that was, it was, was irrational. It was, yeah. You had it in your ear? It, yeah. was, it was unprecedented. <laughs> 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 no, I, I, had it, I, had it, I had it everywhere except for like my face and my dick. <laughs> everywhere but the face and dick. Yeah. How does Ra- it know not to go with the dick? He's a Pokemon and just has Crohn's. No, <laughs> it's, it's very low yeah, level. I have, I have a bad immune system, so. I got scarlet fever when I got strep throat. Yeah. And then 
Um, it was pretty cool because not a lot of people say, can say I got scarlet fever, you know? Yeah, that's I feel like cool. I'm from the medieval times. It is, yeah. I, you yeah, have to work in medieval, medieval times to get that. Yeah. I used to have to wear the scarlet letter because I had a lot of sex. Because <laughs> you were a man whore. <laughs> yeah. with, a lot of, with a lot of pigs. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's fucking every it's bitch in town. Sorry if my dick smells like pussy right now. <laughs> you're, the one fucking all the, you're the one fucking all the corgis. I, did, did, I, was that I your ad? I wasn't in the fucking orgy? a corgi. I was going to an orgy. Can we get an IP address, guys? Fuck, I, so, get so, ash. I get oh, so yeah. ashy, you guys. If I'm looking for an orgy, do I look for a corgi gathering now? Well, huh? Black people complain about being ashy. <laughs> it's it, Only the most respected people who ever lived were ashy, the first responders in 9-11. <laughs> well, yeah. That's, that's so Jamie true. Fox. All those people who died They're in Mount Vesuvius. They're covered in ash. Yeah. yeah. They're great. Uh-huh. Ash Black catch people, the world let, leave them alone. I think there were at least like six or seven... Uh, like World Trade Center towers. There's Johnny, no way there's yeah, yeah. two. Johnny Ash. Yeah. I just stole that from Cam Gillette from last week. <laughs> <laughs> do you uh, like? Do you like Johnny Rash? Do you ever think yeah, it was weird yeah. that no Jewish people died in 9-11? Yeah, I think about uh, it every day. Yeah. How did they know? Like, or they got lucky? I guess. Yeah. Well, it's because they follow I, the they follow the tides. Yeah. I think oh, I think it was Rash Hashanah. Right, so the moon yeah. cycles. I heard when Alex <laughs> Price moved to Indianapolis, the tides changed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have you, have you been to the Alex Alex Pride Parade? <laughs> I heard that. Yeah, who'd you hear that from? <laughs> have you been Did to the you Al- Al- Have you been to the Alex Pride Parade? It's, it's, it's just a bunch of fat guys. <laughs> They're gay. Is it appropriating Pride Month to suck to- dick all year? <laughs> <laughs> all right, Dylan. <laughs> yep. You guys set the bar really low that- with me, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> you said D- Dylan's retarded. They say you, okay. You he, passed the bar I'm exam. Dylan. People call me retarded. Yeah, he's allowed to say it because he is the bar exam. Alex, yeah. remember is Alex would buy haunted stuff. I put huh? bars and drink. Okay, no, 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 no. <laughs> I was gonna make a. Never mind. Were you gonna make a joke this about putting about, things in women's yeah, drinks? Yeah, and it was like I'm. A t- I don't like that. Yeah, Dylan Rufi. I don't. Like, I don't Dylan, yeah, Dylan, Dylan Rufi and Jason <laughs> felt him up. Yeah, Jason. They're felt a tag him. team. <laughs> Rufi him down. I felt him up. <laughs> it is. You do like have, and Are you addressing those? I'm rumors? part part Russian, part Roman. <laughs> are you finally? Coming I got out Russian about that? hands and Roman fingers. Yeah. They yeah. say you can never hear the same joke twice. Uh huh. They do say that. Uh-huh. They've listened to this pod, have uh-huh. they? And they? They hear it a couple more times. So did you live in Chicago? Or no. Or, so you just you just around. <laughs> I'm a round guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah. You, but you just like tour a lot. When he says around. around the house, he says around the house. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, uh, so you're more, well, you're more oval shaped because you're egg shaped, like Humpty Dumpty. <laughs> oval teens are what get me going. <laughs> 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 Little fat pubescent kids. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> can I has that? Oval teens. <laughs> can I has cheeseburger? <laughs> Remember that the yeah, Christmas yeah, yeah. story, yeah. classic. Uh-huh. Uh huh. <laughs> didn't you? Didn't you text me once? I think Mr. Hands is real. <laughs> <laughs> He's still alive. Yeah. He's, he, he does a full, yeah, he does, he does a full bit about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm uh, I'm not big in conspiracy theories. Just that, you're just uh, big. I, I believe in two conspiracy theories. Yeah. One, Mr. Hands is still alive, and two, the Underground Railroad was not an actual railroad. Yeah. <laughs> oh, are we going to talk about your good news? What's my good news? You auditioned for a huge role. Cats? Uh, no, just a big fat guy. Don't, tell you, don't remind me of my cat. <laughs> Dinner roll. He's a huge guy. Good news, folks. I got it. Yeah, it was crescent. The whale too. Uh-huh. <laughs> Judgment whale. <laughs> <laughs> Judgment whale. He, he, he tried out for the you know the Bravo show cats. Yeah, yeah. Who could forget? Go tell well. him about it. He fucked it up though. <sighs> Dressed up as a dog. <laughs> <laughs> It is very important to dress up for the role you're auditioning <laughs> yeah. for. That is classic <laughs> Meisner technique. Yeah. It well, sucks because well, he's a beautiful well, singer. What mm-hmm. kind of dog do you dress up as? Black lab. <laughs> it wasn't the right choice. Yeah, <laughs> you shouldn't have put shoe polish on your face. I know, it's just the only uh, yeah. paint I have. We're anti-blackface uh, podcast. Thanks for saying that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh, you yeah. know Michael Myers? Unless it's a no. comedian. You don't? You Chicago, mean the guy Chicago from comic? Halloween? Uh, that guy in the middle. No. Okay. Well, he's really old, and he wore a blackface on the podcast. Like he's, he thought, yeah, because he didn't understand that's like uh, outdated. And you can't he's do like, it. 
And He's then, like my favorite and guy. And then we're like, Al Jolson does this. Yeah. Why can't I? Yeah. yeah, we're like, dude, you can't do that. He'd be like, this is funny. Ah, I'm black guy. Yeah. And then we made him go wash it off before the podcast. That was big of you guys. Just, yeah. yeah. Well, you, you guys are big guys. <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> just the other day, I tried, you guys to, are big I tried to I heard, I heard when Michael walked to the bathroom from in here, uh, Melton's girlfriend said, what up, young blood? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He said, oh man, what up? <laughs> that, you that, you that, with the movement? That is what happened, actually. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but then when he came back out, she was not happy. Yeah. <laughs> it sucks because I. He did, a, he did a really good job. <laughs> yeah, she was like, how'd this ghost get in my damn house? <laughs> it yeah. sucks when you date black people because you have to actually not like Hulk Hogan. You can't just pretend like you don't. Yeah. You guys on social this media. Is my incredible Hulk. I, I went to stop somebody from wearing blackface the other day. I ran out on the street. I was like, buddy, you better not be wearing that shit. And then it turned out I was just a regular black guy. Yeah, I know. A similar yeah. thing so you can happened never to me. the same joke twice. <laughs> you know, a similar thing happened to me. Uh, I saw, um, I saw a, a black guy, and this was during Black History Month. That's crazy. And, and he was just uh, like uh, sitting on a bench reading something. And I walked up to him. I was like, "Hey, man, I just wanted to. It's uh, like Black History Month. I just want to say we're so sorry about everything the white people have done to oppress you." And it turned out. Um, it was a, a white guy in blackface the whole time, yeah. <laughs> and he was reading Mein Kampf. <laughs> and I was like, "Never mind." Apology yeah. taken back. Yeah. My girl called me read Mein Kampf the other day. I go, "Baby, I just read the articles." Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> mein Kampf and my notebook, favorite books. You need an excuse now, twenty twenty three, to do a blackface. <laughs> Sign of the times. <laughs> I thought I, I, th- I thought it'd be a funny sketch. You better have a good reason. I thought it'd be a funny <laughs> sketch um, <laughs> in my yeah, mind that I'd never make, but like you're playing the song "Paint It Black" by the Rolling Stones, uh-huh. and it, it's like uh, some hot girl painting my face black, and it's yeah. like I have a white face, but oh. I want to paint it black. If Nora <laughs> painted it on that's Jason, the whole <laughs> I think you should run with it. That'd be good. Yeah. No melon camp anymore. I listen John to melon Kodak camp. Black. Yeah, uh-huh. it's a, a melon camp too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if Nora put the makeup on, is that is is that okay? If she put it on Jason, I, yeah. I, I thought about starting a show called Whites Only, but it's all black comics wearing white face. <laughs> I thought about doing blackface at Beer Belly because I was just like, if I did that, it would be really bad. But then people, everyone would know. And you, well, and you live uh, you live two doors down from it, so you could just run away. Oh. It is like an intrusive thought, the idea of putting on black face and going outside. <laughs> yeah. It's the call of the Every void. Every white guy's yeah, secret it's like what? Yeah. 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 It's, it's like It's like the fantasy you have of what you'd yeah. do if like you got mugged or something. Like, yeah. Everyone has that in their head. Everyone just, has that. Just call like, me Justin. Like, what, if, what if I did black face? Yeah. <laughs> just, was... just call me Justin Trudeau. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the, back to the archive. Just the true dad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the joke I said last week. Of course, yeah. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> Just the true. Yeah, got to do it twice. This, yeah. None of this makes any sense. What's uh-huh. going on in here? Huh? <laughs> this is insanity. This, what? Sense. this is pure loco powder, man. <laughs> this, this is like this, this you got local. mumbles the brown over uh-huh. here, just oh, murmuring in my ear. <laughs> Almost just sorry. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. Let's do the news. What is? No, I love it, but I am just like trying to keep up. No, the, I, I just keep looking around. I'm like well, no, this, this whubba, is just whubba, like whubba. Uh, this kind of like uh, fat Beethoven. Whatever yours, what is it called? Fat, uh, fat Bohemoth. It's fat Beethoven. Yeah, it's like fat, fat Beethoven. Beethoven. Yeah. It's that big dog, and it's got a bunch of babies in it, like Chronos. <laughs> yeah, it's the same Bernard that has a bunch of babies in no, it. No, um, the chubby Behemoth Chaser. Yes, yes. Uh, uh, you know that. Uh, I'm just. It's like Whiplash. I'm uh, very much enjoying yeah. uh, just following the whole situation. People call me Whiplash, also. Yeah. <laughs> uh, see, he brings it back. He loves a whip. Uh, his next I whip love your callback. Yeah. Ah, me too. I wish people would call me back. <laughs> yeah, nice. they, they call me Mac. Should we do one of your prank phone calls? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. let's call, call somebody. We gotta call. We call Lund? Who, we, who should call somebody from your biggest, phone, though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, we can call. Yeah, your you phone. Your phone. Your phone's more important than our phones. <laughs> who would be the funniest person to call and be like, "This is Sam Talent." Like, uh, <laughs> they wouldn't. <laughs> yeah, that's what we call Dando Simo. <laughs> yeah, we call Dando like, Simo. I think he's. I think s- they are in Europe. Call Who's Dan- a big fan that's never met him? A big fan, uh-huh. uh, maybe John Hickok. Probably Dat fan. Uh-huh. We could call John Hickok. Well, he, John Hickok guns. is a uh, he's a big Junior Stopka fan. We get a lot about of feedback a, about us all talking at the same how about, time. How about a, True Dat fan? <laughs> and it's a black Asian guy. 
<laughs> what about Justin? About Justin, <laughs> Justin Judo. He's huh. really good at judo. The other, you know, who we had on here, Chan Gillis. It's Asian Shane Gillis. He could do all the impressions and never get in trouble. Mm-hmm. That's perfect. The perfect crime. <laughs> Chan Gillis. He was made in a lab by Lauren Michaels. Made in a black lab. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Uh oh. <laughs> by Porn Michaels, right? Uh-uh. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to get porn, the Bluetooth thing Michaels. to the right thing so that we can call somebody. Uh, Isn't crazy? Isn't it crazy that Lauren Michaels is George Michaels' brother? Yeah. Uh, uh-huh. Yeah. And Brett Michaels. Mm-hmm. Wake me up. Where you go, go? And Michael Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> what about um, a frog mm-hmm. that lives inside of the mouth of a dog? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And he's, he's the dog. frog dog mouth. <laughs> I, I love that, dude. Okay. I'm trying to, <laughs> I'm trying to okay. fit the vibe. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. The, the yeah. Side. We're trying to fit you in this room. <laughs> <laughs> that, was a, that, was a, that was a that was a level five joke. That's good. So, level, yeah, level five is like level four is like the top of like normal comedy, uh-huh. like as funny as it gets. But yeah. then we we've gotten so funny we broke through. Yeah. Oh, the the other side. You're yeah. winking back at comedy over your shoulder. Yeah. So, so level five frog. is the top level of comedy. Is like when, once you're enlightened, you can hit level five. Mm-hmm. Um, it's but, kind of like the amount of sugar in your blood, level five. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But a lot of people, a lot of people, a lot of people, people, a lot of people mix it up. A lot of people mix it up with like five. level like point one. You know, <laughs> been working on my type five. <laughs> um, uh, I think I think you could, I think you could call somebody. Oh shit! I'm calling Drake Daverna right now. Don't call Drake Daverna. I didn't frog, mean to. Dog hog. Smog, have you seen the smoke uh, lady? Jesus call? Christ. Um, Wait, I got someone. Frog, dog, hog. I hope it's me. Snoop, joggy, jog. Yeah, is, as is it working? DJ. Make sure it's on speaker. I don't hear it. Oh, it's on speaker. Yeah. It's not working. Who is it? Hey, what's up? Hey. Oh, you're calling <laughs> Nura. Nura. <laughs> <laughs> and you're, Why are you and calling? you're connected to the Bluetooth? No. Oh, you gotta be. All right, I gotta let you go, Nura. But good chatting. This is this yeah. Is same he's town. breaking up with you. He's letting <laughs> you go. The phone is breaking. Up. <laughs> oh no, dude! What a crazy way to let your lover go. Call Adam Crochet. I would never let no, my lover do go. Not call I love her. No, call him. We had to call our regular Dendo Simo that we call. You guys know anything about uh, <laughs> Dendo Simo's non-binary? Yeah, I know. You guys know anything about uh, charging electric cars? Mm-hmm. Uh, no, I work at Tesla. Do you? I used to. <laughs> I need to charge a uh, Chevy <laughs> Volt before I drive to Waukesha. Oh, really? Yeah. I think you can use like the same chargers. What, like an iPhone? I'm maybe. <laughs> what? <laughs> like an iPhone charger? You probably have a Pi phone charger. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Nice. You know, that's why I became a software developer because I thought I was going to get more Raspberry Pis. Yeah, I thought that you were de- <laughs> you were a soft worm developer because your dick is impotent. He, he, he told I me develop it into a hard. He told me he has. <laughs> He told me he has sciatica in his back. I said, no, you have pie addict. Uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a pie addict. Yeah, when he told me he had sciatica, I, I, was trying. I, I yawned. Oh, shit. Uh-huh. Yeah, sciatica, my ass. It's connected? Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay, it should Crows work now. When you, my ass. Uh-huh. It should work when you call someone now. So if the Chevy call, Volt call thing's not true, Dan? yet it will be. Probably. Who else, who else would we call? It will be universal, but. Mm. We could call this is a free episode. Right? Put that up now. Oh shit! Timestamp. <laughs> Who do you hate? I don't hate anyone. You got to hate somebody. I don't. Uh, what about uh, that guy? I hate that Jeff guy. Christmas. His name's MC Lightsy. He seems cool. No, he ain't. <laughs> no. <laughs> nah, dude. He seems with it. He wears a dangly earring. What about Dan Cass? He's a skeleton. That's a real picture of him. Yeah, Dan Cass. Dan Cats. Uh, yes. <laughs> yeah, he's there. Yeah, Dan Cats. I'm looking around. Yeah. Do you hate Dale McPeak Dylan or Joe Dog. Fernandez or I don't know Brandy, any of these people. Brandon Kiefer? No, I don't that's know awesome. Any of, do you hate any, like, any of those uh, three guys? No, like, kind of prominent. And uh, well, you hate people in Denver. Uh-uh. <laughs> Not a single person. I really don't have any. Oh, uh, do you know, do you know Benver? Yeah, Benver. Uh, so he's a uh, he's a guy named he's a guy named Ben who's yeah, half man Denver. half beaver. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He lives in Denver. Uh huh. Yeah. So these are the shorts that Matt got me. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The gift. 
Oh, sexy so ass. Just another sexy <laughs> ass bald guy. So yeah. in case you didn't know, you I, can read my shorts. I also, I, I also got you a shirt that says uh, <laughs> "Bitches Love My Autism Swag," uh, but I, it's somewhere else. We had a funny, <laughs> funny hats theme the other day, and I got to wear the hat that Jason got me, which says, uh, "Please be patient. I have autism." So <laughs> yeah, that's how I got diagnosed. I got him that when he joined Why don't the you wear it more oh, often? Right. Yeah. Well, it doesn't really fit my head. It's like a snapback style, and, and it doesn't co- cover your cauliflower. No, or your, you just see like a yeah. huge semi circle of skin and i look like a mac miller like make a wish mac miller like a, <laughs> a little kid with cancer i look like yes those hats, you so. know he has cauliflower ear so don't fuck with you're vegetarian i want to eat it kind of popular, uh, <laughs> some people think that autism is the next stage of evolution I actually think it's the previous stage. It's a really but good <laughs> false premise. Some people think it's the next stage. Why are you stage. on your phone? I'm calling Dan Dosimo. Right, oh, thank God. Right. Actually, that Hold might on. be true because I, I might be like... Oh, uh, sh- why, why are you shushing us? Well, I want you it's to just, talk first. It's just then. beeping. I hear it beeping over there. It's busy. It's busy. Call him again. <laughs> This guy only knows no, how to work no, no. a Pi phone, folks. No, it's correct when it was on the last thing. I don't hear it in the headphones. I though. do. It's more of a thigh phone because your thighs are all changed mm-hmm. from using it. Can you guys it's hear the headphones? Fry or no? Phone, no, you I can't hear French anything. fries. You can't hear that? I, no, we don't hear it. I haven't heard a word of this whole thing. Uh, I, I heard it beeping. Well, you on your phone, you calling somebody? <laughs> no, I'm just checking the drive time to Waukesha because I have to leave soon. <laughs> call, um, why don't you call somebody? Yeah, call someone famous. We have to call someone. Yeah, why don't you call someone famous? Bolt. We could call the. Do you know Sam Talent? Call him. Yeah, Chase, Tim Dillon. Call Tim Dillon. Call... He's like uh, Dale McPeak, but Dale McPeak's gay. Yeah. You call Tim Dillon. <laughs> talk business. <laughs> Just shoveling in a joke I made on a previous podcast. And you keep doing, doing it. it. It's yeah. good. I, That's the podcast. I told that joke to Dale. I said that you said it. Nice. That was a good story. I did that he's like a gay Tim Dillon because he has a lisp and he's fat. <laughs> you know what the people really want from you, Sam? What? You know what the people really want? Our fans? Huh. A story about the Let's Comedy Office. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good story. You were there. I don't remember. I, I, I want it. Yeah, I was no, it's okay. Please. Was I Just watching keep... Interstellar? Please. Yeah, you probably were. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll intro it for you. On his face. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I want an audio board for my pod. Oh, this yeah, is it's like a fun, sign dude. of... This is level five podcasting. You need a bunch of noises and kind of gimmicks. donkey, <laughs> donkey. <Yeah. laughs> Making it's pretty sweet when we got the audio board the first time. We oh. just spent the whole episode adding sounds to it, and then everybody complained. Imagine yeah, people seem from... to just complain. No, no, yeah. it's like the whole thing. No, everyone <laughs> yeah. loves. This it's podcast. like, hey, are you a schizophrenic that likes to wear Joker makeup and go to the <laughs> Ren Fair? This is the podcast for you. <laughs> well, if you don't like it, Sam, schizophrenic, <laughs> my <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, <I'm true. laughs> <laughs> I'm schizophrenic. I'm a friendly guy. Schizophrenic. Imagine uh, going from call, Eddie uh, Murphy call being the king of comedy. So Adam Miller. Gilbert was sitting on a couch at the Let's Comedy office, uh-huh. and a woman was saying goodbye to everyone. And as she did, she gave everyone a kiss on the cheek. And Adam was sitting there on the couch, and then she came by and gave him a hug and a kiss. And then he clapped, and he went again, again, <laughs> kiss everybody. And I had to leave the room. <laughs> Because I was laughing so hard. Uh, I do remember that. I remember was the it, smell. Was it a little bit more like this? <laughs> again, again. Yeah. He's harassing women. And it's now okay. You're okay, punching okay, down. <laughs> Literally. Yeah. Yeah. How so else are we going to hit him? <laughs> <laughs> no, Adam, Adam enjoys our podcast. That's impossible. Oh, yeah, yeah. Works. He wants to be on it when he's in town, but he hasn't been in town. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's busy. Yeah, he likes it because we talk shit about a bunch of other people he hates. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. He, he, he thinks it's hilarious. We talk shit about him too. He's we normally talk shit about Chicago comics, but you won't say anyone you hate. Mm-hmm. Well, I don't. You guys keep pointing this. Who's that of you comedy on the wall? Talk about how many other. <laughs> well, we're trying to get you up here. What about Mateo? <laughs> what about Mateo Lane? How do you feel? How do you, great. how do you feel about his lifestyle? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> he's a hot dude. He cooks a lot of pasta. It sounds good to me. He's pretty hot, dude. He's oh a, yeah, he's got a cool mustache. Mm-hmm. Uh, what about? He uh, likes a noodle. Chicago, <laughs> you have a musty. Ash. What about John Mulaney? I don't know. Chicago, this city of brotherly hate crime. I've got a Chicago. How about, Jan- how about Janelle James? <laughs> That's <What>? funny. Oh. <laughs> it was, uh, she was mean to me once. Yeah, I remember. Really? Yeah. What'd she do? Now she's she on that really popular TV show. Yeah, she's dating my friend Jordan. Yeah. <laughs> she she was, cool now? I, yeah, I think so. 
I'm sure she doesn't remember the time she was rude to me at the Orlando Indie Comedy Festival. <laughs> what did she do? I was like, hey, I was I headlined the first night and there was no chairs in the concrete room at Will's Pub. So I was like, you guys got to get chairs in here tomorrow. And then Janelle was headlining the next night. So I went up to her the next night. And I was like, hey, I'm, nice to meet you. I'm Sam Talent. Um, there weren't any chairs in here last night. But I told him to bring chairs. Pairs? In, so. You're talking about? No, no. Go ahead. <laughs> Oh, chairs yeah, yeah. to sit in. Uh-huh. Wait, okay. Is it chair of fruit? Yeah, yeah. chairs of fruit. <laughs> oh. Can I get an electric? Yeah. Chair up. Nice. That's what you get. Mm. Uh-huh. You sit in a chair for too long. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Your, rubs your back rubs against <laughs> the chair. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it was, yeah. It was piatica. Uh, <laughs> Good piatica. Yeah. And what, what happened with the pears? Chair of pie. Mm. Oh, so she was like, uh, you mean pears? Like the fruit <laughs> coming off the tree? <laughs> what? She did so the she same like, joke? I've, I've got a big pear right here. <laughs> oh. Yeah, and I was did like, whoa, this titties? rocks. And then Panama came on, and we did the <laughs> we danced around. Yeah, uh-huh. yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. <laughs> Great. Uh, yeah, it was like, there's chairs. And she was like, chariots? What are we, Roman gladiators? <laughs> what are we going to ride around in here it's and like fight on horseback? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. wow. Yeah. Try how about it. a period? Mm-hmm. How about it? It's uh-huh. a pair you ride I think that would go a, a little something like this. <laughs> <laughs> the New England I wish I had a pair of shoots. And by uh-huh. shoots, I mean guns. I would hold them on you guys. Uh-huh. Yeah. Adam Gilbert, <laughs> one shotgun away. Right. <laughs> I do have to go, guys. Okay. Uh, 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 do you want to say uh, anything uh, about Janelle James? Is she's a big meanie? No, big, no. I tried to. Dumb bitch or anything like that. But, no. then, but, then, I, but then I said, <laughs> I don't even know. Or... He tried to. Then I said, Pears. Pears was good. I, mean, I was just trying to riff. You, you want know? to tell us another story about the office? I remember. I, I don't want to tell you in, uh, anything. Paris, France, <laughs> and I ended up in Pears. <laughs> What about uh, a pair of us France and uh, a couple of guys named France. A pair, <laughs> pair, oh, a couple oh, of friends. I, I figured, I, schizophrenes. I figured out the Bluetooth. Called called Dando, called Dando Simo. Okay. Uh, Dan's not his phone's off. He's in Europe. Oh, they uh, are in Europe. Uh, call call Paul Miller. He's avoiding pickles. Call Paul Miller. Paul Miller, coming right up. And there's a slowdown. Yeah, 24 minutes. Oh, you, you gotta Pichetti's give it a few a minutes backup. away for it to speed up. You know. That's what happened to uh, Dylan when he was born purple. I was born purple <laughs> due to lack of oxygen. Uh, he had a 24-minute so slowdown. Now down. his voice has yeah. a 24-second slowdown. It was Grimace's birthday. Uh-huh. <laughs> we know a girl that looks just like Grimace. Yeah, happy birthday, yeah. Tina Yukana. Tina Yukana, that's Grimace's mom. Yeah. Right, you, you Tim 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 forever. <laughs> is this a person? Yeah, I, I was thinking. Uh, Jesus Christ! Walker no, she she likes when we make fun of her on the podcast. No, she doesn't. Yes, yeah, she does. No one wants to be called Grimace's mom. She asked, she asked she asked ben. her to make fun of her more. Oh my god! <laughs> she, she must be. A, you want to see a picture of Grimace's? Yeah, mom? she, she Wait, like gave hey, me her. Do, do you want phone call? That's All how right. you know you made it in Elkhart, Indiana comedy. Yeah. Is, is when you become you give birth to a. Grimace. Can you guys hear that now? I hear it. Yeah. All right. Cool. Question. Yo, what up? What up, Paul? You're on the uh, you're on the Bad Comedy Podcast. Hey, Paul. Hey, hey Paul. Glad to have you. Hey, Paul. Uh, we're boom. calling all of our friends we know and asking, "Are you gay?" Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, with you, yeah. you know the answer. We got Sam Talon on here. Hey, I'm on here, and I'm asking people, uh-huh. "Do you envy the Islamic lifestyle?" <laughs> and why? And why? <laughs> I do. Uh, What's up, Paul? <laughs> Paul, too scared to get canceled for saying you guys it. don't have jobs. Uh, oh no, no. Dude. no! Yeah, we got blow jobs and we get them all the time. Yeah, yeah. from dudes. Yeah. We, got, we, we got a job yeah. called uh, it's called comedy. Ever heard of it? Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. What's more important? We have a job called writing jokes. Ever heard of doing that? Uh-huh. Hey, yeah. We've hey, got guys, a job called rigging dog fights. Uh-huh. <laughs> Ever heard of it? Yeah. Do, do dogs do they eat dog food or dog feed? I don't remember what it is. He doesn't remember what they eat. Wait, Paul, <laughs> Paul, what do they eat? Dogs. Dylan doesn't know what dogs eat. Clarify. Can you please explain? Uh-huh. And tell us if you're gay and why you love Islam. <laughs> My name is Paul. I'm confused. Uh, I don't know how to answer. I probably hung up. Uh, you still there, Paul? You probably hung up on. I'm this. here. Hey, what's oh, up? Dude? So oh, dude, I'm here. Dude, Are you queer? Do dogs uh, eat? Because we're over it. Do why? dogs eat food or feed? Can you? You hear guys it? are talking over me. Uh, no, <laughs> no dude, shit. That's the whole thing. I got nothing to say, man. I don't think this is legit. You don't uh, think it's real? I hear you, Jason. Oh, can you not hear them at I all? Can hear, so you, he I is, can hear Dylan and Mac and, and 
another person, but I don't know. Another person. He it's, uh, he's another person. Thank you for not it's admitting ham, who I am. It's Ham Trailing. Uh-huh. It's me. This is the, this was the opportunity you had, and it's gone. It's me, Pig Fuck McDick. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not that fun. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> That's, it sucks when they call you. That's doesn't not true it? at all, uh-huh. Paul. You're the most fun guy I know. You're living your life, and then you're bothered by three dwarves. Are you at work, Paul? He's just wrapping up my day right now. What are you hey, wrapping hey, up? For a present? That, thanks for giving me that Uber the other day when I lost my phone. That was nice of you. <laughs> uh-huh. You'll you never get, see you that twenty dollars. Was <laughs> you guys know that I'm a good person? He is. Yeah, he Mac a ride home. Is we found his, his phone. Where's that? His he lost his phone. And we use find my iPhone. Log from his in. Phone. He was like blackout drunk. Uh huh. Uh huh. And we found his phone. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude! I'm a good person. Son. I carry my friend. mom's purse. <laughs> a good person. Risk son. my lift rating. <laughs> it fucked up the lift rating. But, no, no, no! I risked it. No, no, Max no, no, yeah, yeah. I thought Max was me. No, Mac no. was gonna slur the driver. <laughs> That's a risky move. No, you no. Gotta gotta win. I, I'm super nice to Uber and Lyft drivers. You paid a fifty dollar. I worked the customer Crow service. Diarrhea so fee. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah I'm but nice you don't know workers. if you're gonna puke or something in the car. I don't yeah, puke. And when Mac, he's got Crohn's. I don't so. puke. Mr. A. Roney is my father's name. I could have. Oh. Oh. I could. I could have shit the car, but I didn't. I never puke. <laughs> I like that one. That was good. But hey, Paul, we'll let you go, man. Paul, you're free. There used to be a comedian in Chicago named Let's send Noodleman. Was his last name Lester Noodleman? Joe Noodleman. Joe Noodleman. Yeah, and mm-hmm. then uh, he should hang out with Mac, Macaroni and Noodleman. Uh, yeah. They could be craft. We, uh, we, we can make crafts together. Uh, Melton's having Mac an attack. Was a, <laughs> I mean, Joe Noodleman was a good, you know, good dude, dude. I like when he would blink really hard. He was great. <laughs> so you don't believe? Sam, yeah, that's you, always. You, you don't believe Sam Talents here? Do you believe Trayvon Barker was in? No, it? he's not. Why, why would we record on <laughs> no an way. off? Why would we record on an off <laughs> day in the middle of the day? <laughs> Just so you guys know, if you're calling more people, the Sound quality on this call sucks. <laughs> Correct. Uh-huh, well, yeah, so does the joke well, quality. Uh, Thank you, Paul. Yeah, so I'll see you at Beer Belly today. Yeah. That's a wrap yeah. on Paul. Yeah. You're, you're, are you, Mike? I mean, Jason, are you bringing a mic stand? Yeah, I could do that. <laughs> your your funniness is about as good as the audio quality, I guess. It's really good to be really last funny time, off um, stage. <laughs> yes. I brought my own stand, but if you got one, let me know. I, then I could just bring the backpack. You could. Text I got one us. in my car, yeah, so I'll have we, it. You could text about that later. Yeah, could, the, the, we're on yeah. broadcast right now. All right, I'll see you guys later. All right, love you, Paul. I'll see you later. Goodbye, Paul. Love you, bye. It's Miller time. Let's send him to hell. Yeah, I'll send him to hell. Oh, Uh, no, I'm in hell. Uh I'm in hell. Help me. Oh, my God, I'm Uh in fucking hell. We can help, Paul. We have one person to call, and you failed. Uh That's why you're here. I have the Hitler with you forever. What's the deal with that? All right, that? Let's, let's close this off so Ham can get to the talent. I have to mm-hmm. go. Um, all right. Yeah. Well, uh, thank you for he's, coming he's on, Jason. Going, he's going to wash it now. I think it's, it's the first time he's ever been around being washed. <laughs> he's going to wash his paws. Look how tired he is. <laughs> washed to paws. Look how exhausted he is <laughs> after I, two and a half I'm hours. I'm actually on a shit ton of Adderall There's right now. Be like, <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Normally down. Sam's like, wash, wash him? Nah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm never washing myself. Give me some yeah. Adderall. <laughs> I can give you some. Hand it over, numb nuts. Uh-huh. I don't have it on me. I don't get, piss me off, slap I, nuts. I, I, I can give you some. Thank you. Uh, yeah, thank you, Melvin's could, friend. I, I'm heavily. Yeah, me and yes. me and Hammer frenemies uh, now. No, we're friends now. We we kill. We <laughs> yeah, buried yeah. the hatchet. Uh-huh. We, we, we buried the, the, beef, the gun. Hatchet, mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah. Book. All right, cool. Thank you, well, hey, uh, Dylan, thanks for coming on. Thank you, uh, Jason. Thanks for coming. Thanks for on. Me. Do you want to do plugs or something? Mac, thanks uh, for coming on. Yeah, uh, mm-hmm. thank you, mm-hmm. thank you, Ham. We hit the plug uh, button. Y- yeah, we gotta do plugs real quick. Hey, hey, blow up. Blow Dude, up. Rich the kid should have been so much bigger. He's just done. It's been done. All right, we're gonna circle, Dylan. You got any plugs? I'll be in my buddy's Friday. <laughs> Zany's on the twenty fifth. Okay. Mac, did you make that noise? What? You made a pfft sound. Yeah. No. Do you what? have you ever done? That wasn't me. My buddies. You ever done my buddies? I have you ever done been my booked bu- there? 
I literally he, have to go. Just hurry it up. Just my car and, and I have to leave. Right, uh, oh, do you want to plug anything? No. Uh, yeah, Thank you all so much for having me, guys. He has a world guys. tour. Check Thank out you. Instagram for his dates. Yeah, samtalent.com has all the dates. Oh, my yeah. bloodies. Thank you guys. I'm not trying to be a dick. I just yeah, have to no, charge no, a car before brother. I leave. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Do you want help figuring out how to do the electricity? I found a car charging station. I think I'll get to it. Where is it? Somewhere in Chicago. What are the cross streets? You also found uh, your old? new opener, me. I don't know. It's Jason's like, old. It's near news. Skokie. Never again. Oh, that's really. Just, you have to go that far. Well, he's I going guess. to Washington anyway. Yeah, I gotta go is to it Washington. Is it on the way to Washington? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. that'll be fine. There's, right. there's a lot of Jewish people there. It's, Thank it's, you. You're not like almost dead, are you? On the car. Hey, we love he's you. No, the car. The car. Okay, we you're fine, we love you, Sam. Bye. Thanks for coming on. I think I love you, man. Let me shake hands again. <laughs> we love you. Uh, it's love and it's all mutual, we assume. Um, Hell yeah. Later, bro. Jason, normal plugs. You got. Uh, yeah, check out my album recording from uh, last year. And then, uh, again. and then I have no plugs. I'm going right. to do a new album this year. Uh-huh. All right, folks. Well, Peace. Th- thanks for listening. Yeah.